Keenan Alicia, this is a major investigation that impacts agencies across the country, many right here in Michigan. In fact, you can take a look at this map just to get a better idea of just how many agencies and where they are that are impacted. This map shows the law enforcement agencies across the state, including Beverly Hills Police Department, the Pittsfield Township Police Department, and the Detroit Detention Center, in addition to the Michigan State Police. Now, on Monday, MSP announced it is taking all 203 breathalyzer devices in the state out of service until they can be sure they were properly calibrated. MSP says police departments should conduct blood draws instead of breath tests to establish evidence of drunk driving. MSP, uh, the MSP fraud investigation does follow last week's suspension of a contract with the St. Louis based Intoximeters Inc. There's over 200 machines that are being used or that are in use all over the state of Michigan. What do you mean they've been fraudulently certified? Yeah, that's been the reaction really across the board. Although blood draws are an accurate way to measure whether or not you're intoxicated, that does require a warrant. But investigators also say that they look for signs of uh, of driving, weaving as well. But uh, this is definitely a case that we're going to continue to follow closely. Reporting live, I'm Jennifer Ann Wilson, 7 Action News.